According to posts on social media, Ja Shaka, a pioneer in the genres of dub and reggae, has passed away. His exact age and the circumstances of his passing remain unknown. In the 1970s, the singer, producer, and label owner known as Zulu Warrior began operating and touring with the influential Ja Shaka Sound System, which would go on to release some of the most seminal records of the London sound system scene. From the next generation of dub legends like Oration Stebbis and Ja Warrior to post-punk musicians like The Slits and Public Image Lut, Shaka was revered by musicians and dancers of all backgrounds and styles for his spiritual messages and deep, rattling sounds. Up until his death, he never stopped performing or touring his system. As a child of the Windrush era, Shaka relocated from Jamaica to London. He and his contemporaries relied heavily on music as a means of coping with the dangers of their surroundings. Only music, songs, and memories of Africa could be taken by those who emigrated to the Caribbean. In a lecture given at the 2014 Red Bull Music Academy, he explained that this was all people had to keep them together over the years. House parties with 50 or 60 people and only record players were common in London in the 1950s and 1960s. At a time when people were being forcibly segregated, this familiarity between households was crucial. Shaka started working with local speaker builder Freddie Cloudburst around this time, and he was responsible for maintaining Freddie's sound system. He worked on the system for years, eventually playing records and eventually constructing his own. In the 1980 film Babylon, Shaka appeared as himself with his sound system, which had gained a cult following by the late 1970s. Musicians have taken to social media to pay their respects following Wednesday's announcement. So sad to read Ja Shaka has departed this planet. The Bug, a dubstep producer, lamented, Let your soul find eternal rest. One of the few people who cared about dub's survival, this hero, because of his enthusiasm and taste, I pulled many all-nighters. Ja Shaka, the artist Trevor Jackson wrote as a final note, I've been to some wild clubs in my time. But nothing compares to the first time I stumbled into the rocket with a pounding headache and bleary eyes and was completely overcome by the bass. Early life, heavenly music, and D. Aki Master, Young Warrior, Shaka's son, now runs his own record label. Thanks for watching.